day two of uh, May lead coding challenge and uh, the problem is lead code problem number 771 and it's a simple application of uh, has set uh, where we are asked to find uh, how many of the stones you are given is jewel so you are given uh, an array where you are given different types of jewels so for example if this is the jewels array then you see we have three different types of jewels here it will be distinct since we are specifying just the type and here we have another list where we will have some of these types this is the list of stones so some of the stones will be jewels so you have to just return how many of the stones are jewels so what we will do here we will uh, keep uh, this jewels list in a hash set and uh, this is the j s and it's given that it's only letters so from a to small g and capital a to capital g and it's also distinct so there are multiple ways of uh, creating a hash set one uh, is that since you have only 52 characters you can have an array of 52 one for each a to z and next 26 for capital a to capital g or you can use the inbuilt hash set structure of this also so how we can uh, write it so it will not be given like this it will be given some character so like a a b so this means we have three different types of jewels and these small and large are di distinct so a is not same as a and here you will be given a a c b d b b then you will see that yes this is a jewel jewel not a jewel jewel not a jewel capital v which is not in the list so total we have four so this is the way to do it so we keep track of one hash map has set not map jewels and here we put in all the three jewels a a and b and we run a loop for c in s that is we are looping for all the characters in s if c is present in jewels count plus plus and finally return count so that's it so let's quickly see an implementation of this in c++ java and python so we will create an unordered set you can also have an array of size 52 since it's fixed length So we have inserted into map now we will iterate for all the characters of the actual stones list if jewels dot find c not equal to jewels dot end that is we found the stone then we increment the count and finally we return count so let's run it and it works for this case we don't need to try much here let's submit and the solution is accepted in C++ so it was pretty simple now we will just replicate it in Java and Python as well so here we will have a set of character we will call it jables new hash set and for c j dot 2 
C's capital char array jewels dot add and same thing here contains and we are done so let's try it in java and it works so let's go ahead and submit and the solution is accepted as well now finally we will do it in python here we will not even create a set uh, this uh, this is this can be used as asset and let's see how first count equal to 0 then for c in s we will say if c in j so here we are using this string as a set itself we do count plus equal to 1 and we return count so let's see if it compiles there is nothing much here to suspect and it compiles so let's go ahead and submit it and the solution in python is accepted as well so i hope you enjoyed it it was a very simple application of uh, set in c++ java and also python